meeting. Yeah, it was, it was real close all fall camp and uh, just kind of the last week, Giovanni was just on a big uptick, um, kind of separated himself a little bit. And so that's kind of what led to the decision to, to go with him. So it is official. Idaho transfer Giovanni McCoy will be the starting quarterback for the Oregon State Beavers Saturday against Idaho State. McCoy beats out Ben Branson, who is listed on the depth chart as quarterback number two, followed by Jabari Johnson, the third string. McCoy played in 26 games over three seasons for Idaho. He threw for 43 touchdowns with 19 interceptions, totaling 5,834 yards. Coach Bray saying the competition came down to the very end with three very capable quarterbacks, but in the end they decided to go with the redshirt junior. Yeah, he started, he started making the plays we need him to make, the comfort with the offense, and then doing stuff with his legs, which is uh, what we like about him in the first place is not only his ability with his arm, but ability to make plays running the ball when things break down. And that's kind of what we saw that last week. Meanwhile, Ben Goldbranson and Jabari Johnson will have to wait their turn to see the field, but maybe not as long. That's because Coach Bray said they will still be involved in the plan moving forward as this season to get some snaps. Yeah, we're still, we're still, just, absolutely. Uh, ben, we, we, again, a great quarterback. We know we can win with him. He's, he's going to have an opportunity. Same thing with Jabari. So there, there's a plan, and that's kind of what Coach Gunderson's going through right now is what the, exactly that looks like. Well, some other notables on the depth chart. Jam Griffin is listed as the starting running back, but Coach Bray did say expect to see Anthony Hankerson in a lot of snaps as well. And then on the offensive line side, we've got Thurston alum Grant Stark. He earns the starting spot at right tackle.